Welcome to Let's Play Fire Emblem. The Apprentice Tactician Dito and the Young Sword Fighter Lin. <clears throat> a strange pair on, the, on an even stranger journey. Yes, that is my chair. To prepare for the long road ahead. They got to Bulgar, the commercial center of Sakre. Sake? Sak. Saki. <laughs> Unbeknownst to Lin, she will discover something that will alter her life forever. She will no longer be a virgin. I have no idea. I don't remember. I remember the mechanics, but I don't remember any of the story. <laughs> Footstool. Chapter 1. Footstools of Faith. Dixo! Over here! This is Bulgar, the biggest city in all of Sa Sake. We should purchase supplies for our journey. I'm guessing her voice isn't the same, isn't gonna be consistent. <laughs> oh my, what a dazzling vision of loveliness. Dude, back off. Leave the flirting to me. Oh, okay, fine. Let's see who you are. Hmm? Wait, oh beauteous one. And you guys thought my flirting was awkward last episode. Would you not favor me with your name, or better yet, your company? Dude, introduce yourself before asking a lady for her name. That's common manners. Fucking hell. Where are you from, Sir Knight? It's that you speak so freely to a sh- like that. Where are you from, Sir Knight, but you speak so freely to a stranger? Ha! I thought you'd never ask. Here we go. I'm from Lys... 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 Lys Lysia. <laughs> I hail from the... Oh, fuck you. I hail from the Kaelin Canton, home to men of passion and fire. Dude, you're being a little creepy. Shouldn't that be... Home to callow oaks with loose tongues. That's my girl. Oh, you're even lovely when you're cruel. Ugh. <laughs> Shout out to Blue. I have to ask, is this what it's like when I'm flirting? Like, more... Shout out to anyone who knows me. Is this what it's like when I'm flirting? Ugh. Let's go, Deke, so I have nothing more to say. Bitch. Wait! Please! You had your chance. Sane! Hold your tongue! Ah, Kent! My boon companion! What? So severe an expression. If your manner were more serious, I wouldn't have to be so severe. Ouch. You got fucking told, man. We still have a mission to complete, Sane. Sane? Sane? I know that, but how could I remain silent in the presence of such beauty? It would have been dis... No. Discourteous? Discourteous? The fuck do you mean, discourteous? Ugh. What do you know of courtesy? Told you. Excuse me, you're blocking the road. If you would be so kind as to move your horses. Of course, my apologies. Thank you. You at least seem honorable enough. Hmm? Pardon me, but I feel we've met before. I beg your pardon? Hey, no fair, Kent. I saw her first. Fuck you. Tch. It seems there are no decent men among Lysia's knights. Let's go, Deke, so I've run out of patience. Wait, please. It's not like that. <sighs> Saying you lout. Huh? Not like that. 
I thought you were... I am not you! Come, we must follow her. I suspect she might be... Be what? She's our mission? You're joking! Wait! Uh... This is a bad sign. Run! We're being pursued! Could it be those knights from town? No, it's not them. These men are out for blood. <laughs> Aren't you the prick? Your name is Lindus, is it not? What did you call me? Who are you? Such a waste. An absolute waste. The things I'll do for gold. Oh, time to die. Come out, boys. Fuck me. Fuck me. Oh no. There are more than I can handle. But I'll not give up. Hey, there she is. Huh? What? Whew, finally caught up. Hold, you there. What is your business? Such numbers against a girl? Coward! Every one of you! You! You're from... We can discuss that later. It appears these ruffians mean to do you harm. No shit. If it's a fight they want, let them look to me. You! You! You are called Deekso. I want to impress my beauties one. Let me attack first. <laughs> Keep your paws off my girl. Alright, be warned. If Lynn is defeated, your journey is over. As is your game. If other blue units are beaten, the game will continue. But fallen companions will be unable to return to battle for the rest of the for the rest of the tutorial. Use caution and good judgment. Mm. After all blue units have moved, it's automatic it automatically becomes the enemy's turn. To begin with, select same. Put place the cursor on same and press the punch button. No! Press the A button! I wanna punch it. No! Attack! Move me to a space next to my foe. You say so. You're fucking retarded! <laughs> Whoa! I missed? Sane! Why aren't you using your sword? The lance is more heroic. A knight should look heroic, don't you think? You're hopeless. If you don't take fighting more seriously, you're going to find <clears throat> you're going to find yourself on the end of a blade. Truth be told, I forgot to buy a sword. Forgot? Or were you simply too busy down? Being with the ladies. Ouch. Don't be so mad. I'll be fine with a lance. I'm that good. I prefer to rely on your skill, not your empty bragging. Double ouch. Take my spare blade and use it to attack next time. Are you sure? My thanks, Kent. You're almost more trouble than you're worth. Almost. Dixo, allow me to make up for my companion's blunder. I am at your command. Weapons possess a unique hierarchy. Swords, best axes. Axes, best lances. Lances, best swords. This is called the Weapon Triangle. Remembering this 
it's of the utmost importance. <coughs> First, let's illustrate that swords are strong against axes. Select Kent. The enemy wields an axe. Use a sword for my attack. What? Totally wrong voice. <laughs> He's almost defeated. Now, let's deliver the final blow. Yes, sir. You must move next to the enemy. Time to die, fucker. Deek, so give me another chance. Fuck you. You're gonna get yourself killed in a minute. Axe-wielding foes should be met with swords. Brandish your blade! And you miss! And you still miss! Gah! Sane! Are you alright? Yes, yes, I am. I was able to dodge in time. I can't believe he evaded my sword stroke so easily. This is no jest. Look close. The enemy is hidden in the woods. The branches make it difficult to attack, don't they? You're right. I was so focused on attacking. I didn't see. Damn right you didn't see. You lack of attention. Your lack of attention may someday cost you your life. Fine. I understand already. Let it go, Kent. If you're tr you truly understand, then act like it. Kent worries too much. He's going to grow old before his time. Each type of train has unique characteristics. For example, look at woods and plains. Battle an enemy from the woods, and the enemy will, <coughs> will likely miss you. However, your attacks will be unimpeded, giving you a distinct advantage. Same is true for foes. The enemy is in the woods, he is more difficult to hit. Factoring in your terrain benefits and the weapon triangle is vital in combat. The window at the bottom of the screen gives information on the terrain the cursor is placed on. Check to see what terrain type is advantageous by using the cursor. Now, let's put this to, select, to the test. Select Kent. I'm ready for battle. Command me as you will. Let's use my sword to attack. Yes, sir. Seems like a wise decision to leave <coughs> to leave that bandit to the knights. For my part, I'm going to take care of the other foe. I need to get I'll need to close the distance between us. The knights said the woods are advantages, right? In that case That looks like a good place. Let's move there, Deep so. Sane, right? Yes! Sane, the gallant man of Salem. That's me. If you insist, why have you not healed yourself? Huh? Hey, I've been injured? I... I am face palming so hard right now. What a cat I am! To wrinkle that perfect brow of your yours with worry for me. Uh, I was thinking of giving you a vulnerary, but 
looks like you're fine, so never you mind. No! Wait! I'll take it! Please! I'll take it! <laughs> Let's use the trade command now. Select Sane and move him next to Lin. I can't keep such a generous offer. You're fucking retarded. The healing power of love awaits with yawn angel. Oh god. This is going to be a thing. Deekso, tarry no longer. Ugh. <laughs> uh, god damn. Saying you're horrible. <laughs> Furthermore, mounted units have the unique ability to move again. Essentially, this makes cavalry move the number of spaces left movement range if they haven't done so already. However, the attack command, amongst others, nullifies the move again ability, so be careful. <clears throat> Select Sane and have him move again. Ah, much better. Thanks, Deeksa. And you have my gratitude as well, my angel. Uh, here. This goals change from chap mission goals change from chapter to chapter. This goal's goal this This chapter's goal is to defeat all enemies. Check the chapter goals in the window on the upper right screen. To open the map menu and place the cursor on it. Ah, fuck it. Uh, basically that's just menu shit. That I don't really have a reason to deal with right now. Um, gonna be ballsy and move you up to here. Meanwhile, you, yeah, you're gonna finish him off from inside the woods. Okay, not what I thought you were gonna do, but that works. And go ahead if you want, but uh, you're dead. Fuck off. Come on, hit me. Nope. Pink. <clears throat> Saying I don't like you. I don't care if you start to lose X. You have a better movement range. Because Sane has a really fucking huge range of movement. And I really like that. Don't like his character. Not at all. Move to here. Wait. Move up to here. Wait. You move over to here. And wait. Okay, you can move there and there. Peek. Alright. Now you attack the boss. Accursed knights! Always tampering in others' affairs. Fuck you. 
No, sir. Fuck you. No, saying fuck off. Can't you attack him? Hmm. And who do I want to get the axe for? I want Lin to. I'm so sure. And you're dead. Have a nice skill. Not really. Go to hell. Blast! There was only supposed to be a lone girl. Then why did you send four guys on her? Holy fuck! I know I'm a badass, but fucking seriously. That's the last of them. Fantastic work, Deekso. Thank you. <clears throat> and now for these Knights of Lycia. You were going to share your story with me? Yes. We have ventured from, say, one in Lycia to serve of someone. Mincia? That's the country beyond mountains in the southwest, isn't it? Correct. We've come as messengers to the late Lady Madeline, who were locked with a nomad some 19 years ago. Madeline? Our lord, the Marcus of Salem's only daughter. He was heartbroken. His own daughter would abandon him, so. Eventually, the Marquis simply declared that he had no daughter. And then this year, we received a letter from Lady Madeline. It said that she, her husband, and their daughter were living happily on the Se Seke Plains. The Marcus was ex was ecstatic to learn he had a granddaughter of 18 years. <clears throat> I remember the smile on his face when he announced that, that he'd suddenly become a grandfather. So she's legal. Oh. Oh. The granddaughter's name is Lindis. Oh, okay. I'm saying it you now. There's also the name of the Marcus's wife who passed away hey, at an early age. Lindis? That she should bear his name thawed the Marcus's heart. Now his only wish is to meet his daughter's family at, la at least once. Well, it kind of sucks for you. This is why we're here. We didn't know that Lee, Lee Madeline died a few days after sending her letter. We only learned this shortly after we arrived here in Bulgar. And you guys have no idea who you're talking to. But we also learned all was not lost. Her daughter yet lives. We heard that she is living alone on the plains. Not anymore. I, I knew it immediately. You are Lady Olympus. Why would you think that? Your resemblance to your departed mother is remarkable. What? Did you know my mother? <laughs> oh god. <laughs> this is wonderful. Acting check. <laughs> See, I'm sorry to say I never met her directly, but I saw her portraits in Castle Salem. The rest of my tribe, I was always Lynn. But when I was with my parents, when it was just the three of us, I was Lindis. It's all I. It's all so strange. I was all alone in the world, and now I have a grandfather. Lindis, 
I never thought I would hear that name again. Hmm. Wait! That bandit! He called me Lindus too! What? How could he have... He was a henchman of Lord L Lundgren, wasn't he? Lundgren? 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 Fuck you, Fire Emblem. Who's that? <clears throat> He's the Marcus's younger brother. Everyone assumed the late Madelin was gone forever. This made Lord Lundgren heir to the Marcus's title. To be blunt, milady, your existence is an obstacle to your granduncle's uh, ambitions. That's... But I have no interest in inheriting any title. Uh, unfortunately, your granduncle is not the type of... It's not the sort of man to believe that. I believe the attempts on your life will persist. What should I do? Accompany us to Salem. Continuing on this way, way is dangerous. I feel I have little choice. I will go with you. Good. Dixo, I'm sorry. This changes everything. What will you do, Dixo? You want me to decide? My beautiful- No, I'm not being sane. I will accompany you anywhere you want me to go. Of course, your companionship would do much to ease my journey. But, it's going to be so dangerous, and I will stick beside you and defend you. Or I guess it's supposed to be the other way around. You'll come? Are you sure? Thank you. Anytime, my dear. Let me ask once again for your friendship and your aid. And of course I will say yes, as always. And until next time...